Hi everyone, this is Dr. K. So I wanted to say, say hi to you again. I wanted to briefly talk about uh, curcumin and how it can uh, help your immunity today. So as we discussed uh, on, on the previous video, the ACE2 receptors uh, are very important uh, in uh, deciding if you get a COVID-19 infection and if you do get it, then how severe it's going to be. So the more ACE2 receptor activity, the more ACE2 receptors you have in the body, the better it is for you. So there's more production uh, from the research that I've noticed. So uh, from previous research, we already know that uh, curcumin increases the ACE receptor activity and it increases the ACE2 receptor, so ACE receptor. So, so based on the, you know, obviously there are no studies uh, that, that would prove conclusively that uh, curcumin is going to protect you from COVID-19 at this time. But based on two, uh, those two research uh, studies, um, I would uh, believe that you know, curcumin will have some amount of productive uh, activity against uh, COVID-19. So the people who take uh, curcumin for arthritis, they take somewhere around 500 milligrams or 1,000 milligrams once a day. Uh, for curcumin, uh, the recommended amount of dose is either 1,000 milligrams three times a day or 3,000 milligrams daily. So um, it's ideal to take the, uh, the tablet or the capsule. Um, if you're interested in using turmeric with your cooking, you can do that. Typically, uh, in most Indian cooking, uh, people consume around 2,000 milligrams of uh, curcumin in, in the turmeric when they use turmeric. So, um, so it has uh, a significant or a well-known uh, effect on inflammation. It reduces the inflammation. We know uh, from looking at the patients and looking at the studies from China that uh, COVID-19 causes uh, increased inflammation, especially in the lungs. It causes uh, what's known as cytokine storm. So anything that can reduce the inflammation would really help in uh, either fighting the COVID-19 infection or uh, reducing the uh, morbidity from the COVID-19 infection. So I would highly recommend taking uh, curcumin if uh, possible. Uh, this is in addition to all of the regular lifestyle, you know, sleeping well uh, at least 68 hours a day, uh, working on nutrition, eating more fresh foods, more vegetables, more fruits, uh, anything that brings in antioxidants into the body. So, uh, and trying to um, stay away from the TV and not watch any fear-based news. So, um, so I briefly want to talk to you about this. Uh, if you have any questions, you know, comment below. If you want to reach out to me directly, you can send me a DM. Um, you can always call the office. Um, we're also uh, planning on doing a uh, major, um, uh, hi Lorena, thanks for watching. We're also planning on doing a major, um, like a um, teleconference call with uh, a, a with an expert, like an infectious disease doctor, that is coming up. I plan to do that um, on April 18th. That's going to be on a Saturday. I haven't decided a time yet. I um, I'll give those details to you in the next few days. Uh, we had to look at our schedules and see what would be a good time to arrange that uh, teleconference. So um, it's going to be a Q&A format. So if you have any questions, you can go ahead and prepare those over the next uh, two weeks. And uh, we'll try to answer all of those questions uh, when, uh, when I bring in the expert presenter. So it's going to be on what is known as a WebEx platform. So I'll, I'll give you that link uh, closer to the date when, when I have everything set up. So I'm really excited to do that. Um, so I excited to bring in a uh, infection expert, especially one who works in a flagship hospital, seeing a lot of COVID-19 people. So that's, um, so that's what I'm, uh, that's the expert that I'm going to bring for you. So if you have any questions, feel free to um, prepare uh, on that day on April 18th. Uh, meanwhile, I'll do uh, daily videos. I'm going to talk about uh, uh, some of the su supplements over the next few days. If anything comes up in the news, which is big news, I'll also talk about that. If you want me to talk about a particular topic, uh, comment below. Uh, as I said, as always, I'm available to do a, um, a private call if you need to reach out to me personally. So uh, look forward to talking to you all again. Have a wonderful night, okay, bye.